back, Captain Fruitcake here. Um, we're gonna go back into the game Raid, Shadow Legends that I'm playing. Um, I want to talk about building your heroes and the different ways that you can boost the stats of your different champions as well as the fractions itself and everything. So, uh, first thing I want to talk about is the champion itself. So if we jump in to say my Brachus the Shifter like you saw in my last video, we you want to look at what type of hero they are, especially what type of skills they are offering, give or take the statistics of what they're offering. So if you see here, his primary skill is going to be a one enemy that he attacks and heals his champion 15% of the damage inflicted. So obviously the more damage he does, the more he's going to heal himself. Um, his next skill, as you see here, uh, I haven't finished his last cooldown, number 7. So he'll do it every 3 turns once I get that one done. Um, he attacks uh, one enemy 6 times. Uh, this is uh, extremely beneficial in a few different phases of this game. Um, we'll go into a different ways uh, that can be beneficial. Uh, some bosses require um, so many hits before you can really subdue damage. Um, so having champions that can do multiple hits can be extremely beneficial. Uh, you're going to see a lot of increase, decrease attack, and a lot of skills that you're going to be getting used to, like on this one, True Fear, Fear, Fear Itself debuff. Uh, these are great, great buffs and debuffs that are going to help you overwhelm enemies itself. Um, fear and True Fear are ones that are extremely beneficial to... Uh, stop a unkillable or uh, block debuffs from being cast so uh, you can uh, they don't get their turn so uh, we'll go into a lot of those uh, features later um, when you're building your champions those are a lot of the things you want to take into account what the abilities do are they healing are they defense offense what's going on you know what i mean all around you can build heroes so many different ways uh there are so many different types of armors that you can put on your champions as you can see i'm scrolling through all these right now there are so many that we will go into later um these are what you're going to be using to create your guys um, you can be creative as well as use some guides that some others have put on their sites. Um, uh, Yummy Love is one that I use. Uh, he's a, has a great uh, web page set up. Um, I love it. So, um, yes, outstanding. Uh, other ways that you're going to boost your champions is through their masteries. Masteries are going to help, especially on your offense, defense, and support. Give or take what that champion does, what that champion's position is, uh, is going to be dependent on what you want to do for their masteries. As you can see on uh, Brackus the Shifter, we have nothing but offense and support. So he's doing nothing but crit, damage itself here, crit, crit, as well as inflict the under shield, extra damage under anybody that is under shield. And then over here, I have nothing but accuracy so that he maintains whatever he needs to hit him with. The true fear and fear that I was talking about, that's definitely going to end up hitting the target if you have higher accuracy. As you see over here, on his accuracy and total stats, you can take a look and see that it's over 200 right there on the end, which is extremely beneficial. Um, other ways that you're going to be able to boost your champions is through the Great Hall. Uh, you're going to gain all of these through Arena. So in order to boost your Great Hall, you're going to want to get as far as you can in the tiers through Arena. Uh, other ways you're going to be able to boost your champions is through our, the Fractions Guardians. 
Uh, this is a place where you can uh, boost each fraction and the type of champion. As you can see, rare, epic, legendary, uh, common, uncommon, unfortunately, they're out of luck. Um, this is going to really boost a lot of those stats that uh, is going to be extremely beneficial for you. So, as you can see, extra health power, attack, accuracy, resistance, defense, and speed. Extremely beneficial to help your champions out. Give you some additional strength, health power, defense, speed, you name it. It's going to provide you what you need. Um, we'll go into dailies later. Something that you're going to want to do to get free stuff. So as you click on here on quest, you're going to have daily quests that you're going to want to be completing daily as well as weekly. As long as you do your dailies, you'll complete your weeklies and your monthlies. These are where you're going to get your ancient shards and your epic shards and all the other shards that are going to help you get all the champions that you need. So uh, I'll go into uh, dailies on my next video. Uh, we'll talk to you guys next time.